All right, this video is going to be all about symmetric matrices. So a symmetric matrix is going to be a matrix that is equal to its own transpose. And what that means is if you exchange the rows for the columns and make the transpose, those two matrices are going to be equal. That matrix is called a symmetric matrix. So down here I've written matrix A is symmetric if and only if the transpose of A is equal to A. And another way to think about it is, if you think about an element with a row number i, where i is the row number, and j is the column number, j is the column number, then if you switch the row number with the column number, you get the transpose. And if those two elements are equal for every single element in the matrix, then you have a symmetric matrix. So what I wanted to do with this example was I'm given a two by two matrix and I wanna take its transpose. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a capital T as an exponent. This means transpose. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make the transpose of this matrix. So the way I do a transpose is I write the rows as the columns. The first row is one, two. The first row is one, two. So that's gonna become the first column, one, two. And then the second row is two, one, two, one. That's the second row. So the second row is gonna become the second column, two, one. So now this is the transpose. And now notice these two matrices are the same. So this matrix must be a symmetric matrix because the transpose is equal to the original matrix. Now up here, I have a little diagram of how a symmetric matrix works. If you look at the main diagonal, which is going down from the top left to the bottom right, what you'll notice is the blocks that are opposite each other of the main diagonal are going to be the same. So this color is the same thing as this color, this color is the same as this color, and this color is the same as this color. And that works for every single block that's opposite of each other on the diagonal. So that is a little diagram that shows you how symmetric matrices work. And if you look down here, I gave a little statement, all symmetric matrices must be square. That means that if you have a symmetric matrix, it must be a square matrix. And obviously there's a proof of this somewhere, but I haven't made it yet. Let's move on to these other two examples. Okay, so what I wanna do is I wanna determine whether the given matrix is symmetric or not. And what I need to do to figure out if it's symmetric is I need to take its transpose. So I'm gonna put a capital T as an exponent and I'm gonna take the transpose of this matrix. And then since this is a three by three, I should end up with a three by three since it has three rows and three columns. Okay. So the first row is one, two, three. So I'm gonna write that as the first column, one, two, three. So all I'm doing is I'm writing the rows as the columns or vice versa. You can write the columns as the rows, okay? The second row is going to be two, three, one. So I'm gonna write that as the second column, two, three, one. So the second row becomes the second column. And then the third row down here is gonna become the third column, three, two, one. I can write that as the third column, three, two, one. And now I'm done with the transpose. So I'm gonna close up this matrix. And what I notice is these two matrices are not the same, right? The first row looks like it's the same, but then once you get to the second row, this element is not the same thing as this element. Therefore, this matrix is not symmetric. Not symmetric. Okay. And then uh, the bottom row, of course, it's not the same either because this element is not the same thing as this element. So obviously, this matrix is not symmetric. Now, moving on to number two, I'm gonna take the transpose of this matrix and we'll see what we get. So what we need to do to take the transpose is to write the rows as the columns. 
Now this is also a three by three, just like the last one was. So it's transpose should also be a three by three square matrix. Okay, so the first row is <clears throat> one, seven, three. That's gonna become the first column, one, seven, three. And then the second row is seven, four, five. That's gonna become the second column, seven, four, five. And then the third row is three, five, six. That's going to become the third column, three, five, six, three, five, six. And then I'm done, so I close it up. And I noticed that these two matrices are the same. So the transpose of this matrix is equal to the original matrix. Therefore, the matrix is symmetric. It is symmetric. So in conclusion, symmetric just means that if you take the transpose, you get the same matrix back. And that is all about symmetric matrices.